Your Majesties, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for always returning. Trust you and yours are well, and you're loving yourself and others like always. Many thanks to all of you for the support you give to the channel. Thank you so much to our channel members, to our anonymous supporters, to all of you, my esteemed subscribers. You are loved, celebrated, and appreciated. So today, I would want us to. Talk about the reasons why Africans have Neanderthal DNA. Yes, because there is a little bit of some of some Neanderthal DNA percentage in some Africans. Why do you think that the melanated race man have their Neanderthal DNA in them? You know, on this channel we've talked a lot about interracial yes it's not because i hate i hate it that um, people found love in other races and they are married and living so well on the internet on youtube on tiktok everywhere you might think about you see a lot of interracial propagated recently recently because um many years ago it wasn't like that there was a time that the white race would never want to interbreed anyway they do it um, time to time there are times that they will say okay just interbreed yeah. uh, because uh, 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 you understand and then there'll be a time that prohibits it it's to be a taboo to see a white girl in love with a, a melanated man or a melanated a, a white man in love with a melanated woman and they face a lot of challenges we hear to hear stories and a whole lot, lot of things majesties we've talked about that here before now okay now the more we keep polluting our gene the lesser we become we keep asking questions why do we have betrayers amongst us why do we have um people who might look like us but might not have us at heart it boils down to most of these things that we take for granted okay it boils down to it interbreeding interbreeding there are races that existed because the melanated interbreeded we are the cause of our problems that's why most of the times when we look for solution to what is happening to us it's not far away it's within us the solution to our problem is in you is in me there are times you just have to think outside the box just think outside the box and the answers are just the answers have just been there waiting for you to just think outside the box you get solution answers to most of the problems around us as a melanated people just think a little bit abnormal <laughs> yeah i'm using that word abnormal because people might look at you like you're crazy something is wrong with you 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 might be racist you might be this that's why it's abnormal just think There'll be, there, there are times in life that you need to think abnormal. And you just find the answers to some of the things um, that might, you might think do not have answers to. You have answers to them. Listen to these heated arguments. And the part two of this will be in another video. But this is the part one. Let's listen to these arguments and we take it up from there. Are you a Neanderthal? Do I look like I came from the Caucasus mountain? No, but <laughs> I looked at some pictures of some Neanderthals and honestly, if I look at you, kind of similar. If I look at myself, not really at all. First of all, that's a very stupid thing to say because it, it just sounds how dumb and how uninformed you are. Because Neanderthals existed in the Eurasia region, Europe, Asia. If you do some DNA analysis on me, yeah, guess the amount of uh, Neanderthal traits you find in me. Zero. Yeah, but, I read. But Europeans, they have three to five. Well, maybe two percent. percent. Three to five Some percent. Asian, Asians have more, but Europeans have like tops two. But I read about that. It doesn't mean that no Africans have it. Cause Homo sapiens, if you read about Homo it. sapiens existed in Africa 200,000 years ago. And the world today is dominated by Homo sapiens. Yeah, they are no Neanderthals. That's true. We Neanderthals yeah. are extinct. They bred you know, with Homo each other. Homo sapiens interbreeded with Neanderthals yeah. to form you guys. So if if it wasn't for Africans like myself, you would have been extinct too with the Neanderthals. 
But we're all human today, right? We go on the same to, thanks race. Thanks to Africa. Thanks to me. Mm. Thanks to my ancestors. Mm. Because without us, there will be no you. So who is the real God here? Look at the world. Who is the real we God? Created, you guys we created us? you. We created you guys. Do you know that, uh, I don't know if it's, if it's in the 18th century, 18th or 19th century, the white scientists, they were trying to prove that Africans are inferior because they are descend out of Neanderthals. But today, it is proven that Africans have 0% traits of Neanderthals. Some Africans, But white yeah. people, Caucasians now, they have 3 to 5%. Two. Even if it's one, you guys are still, you know, linked to the Neanderthals. And so what? Not, not Africans. That's not an issue you for me it? at all. Because look at the world today. If you hate black people, why don't you, you know, put up a Neanderthal flag and say, hey, I'm Neanderthal, I'm Neanderthal. Because but, we're not Neanderthal. But you guys won't do that because, because you know that Neanderthals, Neanderthals are primitive. The homo yeah, sapiens homo existed sapiens. in Africa. We all come from And Humor strived. Because... Thanks to Africans. You should worship Africans. We created you. Africans created you. Without us, you would have been extinct. Yeah. And then Together what with your family tree of Neanderthals. And then what happened? I don't have an issue if I have 1% or 2% Neanderthal. I'm so, not a Neanderthal. So the thing is... It's a irrelevant, no, irrelevant I don't, thing to I don't, say. I don't have any issue you claiming to be homo sapien, which you have I every right to. I am homo sapien. Yeah, you are homo sapien. But you like have you. to. But you have to recognize the fact that you became homo sapien by indoctrination. The real homo sapiens, which are Africans, they interbreeded with your ancestors yeah. so that you can survive, so that you can which continue we did. to exactly. exist. You get yes, it? Yes, we, and we because did. Because Neanderthals, they didn't strive. They didn't strive, but they did breed. They were extinct 40,000 years sapiens. ago. They, they bred with yeah. homo sapiens, with Africans. Let me exactly. stop saying homo sapiens. Let me start yeah. saying Africans. As you wish. They bred with Africans to form you guys. That is why you are existing today. Without that interbreeding, oh my God, the, the world would have been a better place. <laughs> Your Majesties, this is an argument that may sound, uh, a heated argument that may sound be funny because they want, to look, want it to look like it's funny so that it doesn't aggravate some things in some people, okay? But <laughs> then what she said, some Africans, the reason why, there is this why idea of some Africans have a lot of Neanderthal uh, uh, DNA is in them. Why do you think so? It's the rate of the breeding. You know, we've talked about the creation story here, not just the one of the Bible. There was um, a series I started here, and I told you we started a series here about the creation of, of us and how people evolved people came to be because some people had some breeding done people existed because original man had an affair with some things and some people are existing today it's not right to the system i'm just happy that you know whenever i hear things like this it's attested to the, the fact that i know already the truth that i am aware of already okay that's why when i keep telling you here to know yourself know who you 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 have a home as a husband as a wife know who you're okay to procreate with it's not just oh this is where my heart wants to go to is that where your brain also wants to go to because most of the times we allow our hearts to just you know get the better of us and we don't think a lot of melanated people have fallen into the trap of this whole thing. And I tell you, there are times they allow this thing to just go interbreeding, just go. You mustn't love the person, just go have an affair, have kids, and sometimes these people are paid. These ladies are paid to just get our men and have kids. Okay? There is something I saw online about this couple. I don't know. Of course, you know them. They're a very popular couple. Um, recently, I, I, I saw something about them. Uh, what do you call them? Um, Risa and Kwan. Yeah, that's that couple. And there was an argument both of them had that was heated and it went viral on the internet because I think they have a lot of following. I think that was why I saw that even because um, I don't I don't really know them like that, but I got to realize that they're they're very popular. 
Now, the lady did not have two, two kids, two boys, right? And it's like she don't really want to marry this guy, this, this uh, melanated king. But they have kids. You know, when I saw the whole thing happening online with the way people were siding the girl or the side the guy or this and that, I was just smiling all through. I hope you understand what I'm saying. I'm not saying I'm not saying anything. I'm just drawing your attention to something. You see? So you are okay to have kids with someone you don't really love and want to settle with because the guy I think he wanted to propose they are preparing for he in his mind he has a wife already. They have two kids. Two boys. He have a wife already, he's happy, he ha he's having a fulfilled, he has a fulfilled life already, dream life and everything, and the woman he has beside him, he believes that this is his wife. And it's just so normal that they have a marriage, a wedding, a marriage done. And she was not so cool with the marriage thing. Some of them, some of the followers were like, she's not ready yet. Something like that. Because I don't see the reason why she don't... Anyway. Anyway. So they allow these things happen. These are just it's just just I'm just giving you an example of interracial couples out there. A lot of them, a lot of them out there that just come together, have kids, come together, have kids, come together, have kids. The girl might not necessarily be in love with the guy, but it's just it. Let's have kids. Because it wants <laughs> some race to keep surviving. They'll make it normal. I bet you, you see how Abigail said this. There'll be a time that you won't be seeing this whole interracial rampart anymore on the internet. You won't be seeing new couples coming up. White and black marrying. I'm sorry I'm using that word. Just to your face. There'll be a time. Because before this time came, there was a time where it was a taboo. Now it became normal. It was just so normal. Everywhere you see them loving and doing everything so beautiful. <laughs> you see? There'll be a time it will be no more. That will be time where they are okay with the number they've breeded with, they've, they've gotten out of breeding. They are okay with what they have gotten out of the melanated people. They'll stop it because they wouldn't want you to come and overshadow them. The more they keep breeding, they might be wiped out. Because originally they weren't even existing normally. It was because of your ancestors breeding with some things that they came to be. This is hard. But I want it to come to your face like this, so that you know what you are doing. You know what you are doing. When the world tells you that the melanated people amount to nothing, you should know who you are and debunk all those lies that have been in history about us. Your Majesties, without us, there would be no... I'm gonna see you in my next one. No, I'm not gonna finish that statement, Your Majesty. So, oh my goodness, so that Abigail will be looked at someone who is racist. But this is education, and it's for educational purposes. Know yourself. Know what you worth. Know what you worth. The melanin in your skin is traded for some huge amount of dollars per kilogram. You understand now? Everything about what you have in your being and your system, they are hunting for it so that they can keep surviving. Hmm. Anyway, I said I'm not going to talk and I'm still talking. Leave your thought there at the section and I'm going to see you in my next one. Until then, love yourself, love others. Stay safe, stay positive always, your majesties. Bye for now.